You know something, I can't believe she tricked me. This woman here tricked me into thinking she was one of the new divas who wanted to become an MWE diva. I can't believe I was blinded not knowing that this woman would be Chris the Icon Kennedy. Former MWE Women's Champion and she is being accompanied to the ring by the very man who orchestrated this whole thing, the Patriot. And just so you people know, the Patriot is an SWA trying to become SWA World Heavyweight Champion. I hope all hope he doesn't become champion. As you can see there, there's Christy Icon Kennedy letting the MWE fans know that she's back and that no one in the MWE Diva locker room is safe. Especially this woman coming down to the ring the very woman who challenged Christy Icon Kennedy. Her name is Beth Madison. You know what? I applaud her courage and valor into facing Christy Icon Kennedy because at Final Apex she was the one who found D Hollywood unconscious and was able to get the EMTs to um, es escort D, D Hollywood out of the um, out of the arena just so they can check up on her. And Christy Icon Kennedy, like the egotistical tramp that she is, was supposedly taking credit for Dee's attack. But the thing is, Christy Icon Kennedy wasn't even anywhere near the arena. So, it couldn't be Chris Kennedy. Anyway, referee calling for the bell. Both of these ladies starting things off with a elbow tie-up, elbow collar tie-up, and Chris Kennedy, oh man, with a reverse atomic drop on D, not on D, but on Beth. I don't know why I said D because D's no longer here. There are times I wish D Hollywood would just get better and return and and give Chris Kennedy a lesson she will never forget. And speaking of such, Chris Kennedy with that inverted figure four on Beth is able to try to fight off Chris. Trying to go for a male Rana but gets countered. Chris Kennedy, Irish whip, nicely ducked by Chris. Don't know why and get sent over the top rope and knocked to the outside of the ring there's the Patriot I don't know I don't know why he's still here man now that Joker there should be fired I'm talking about the Patriot but anyway oh man Hurricane round a pin by Beth I guess we're about to see a no we're not about to see a win here because Chris was able to get the shoulders up drop kick across the face or the chest of Beth Madison as she once again puts in that inverted figure four on Beth. Beth is in big trouble, ladies and gentlemen, as Chris Kennedy is in control of this match. Setting up a nice decent scoop slam onto her arm and a running elbow drop on Beth. And she got planned here. Oh man, trying to take out the, the back of the knee. And we see Beth still trying to fight back here. I don't blame her. Or gets hit with that X Factor. She gets hit with that X Factor, and now she's about to go up on top. About to go for the the Icon Splash, the Icon Corkscrew Splash, and now going for the cover here. Referee counting it two, and only got two. Beth was able to survive the iconic Corkscrew Moonsault, or the Icon Corkscrew, whatever it's called. Phoenix, not Phoenix, but Beth was able to clothesline Chris onto the cold concrete floor. Beth, if I were you, I wouldn't show off because you'll make a fail mistake just like right here as she was able to try to hang her out the dry. Back suplex executed by Chris Kennedy. The Patriot is lacking every moment of this. Reverse atomic drop, headlock grapple by Chris Kennedy. Going for a nice little hip toss. I don't know what she planned on doing, but if it was a submission, it gets gets countered as Beth tries to fight back. 
Not bad of a headlock there. Elbow to the head of Chris. But Chris is fighting back. Drop kick to the face of Beth Madison, who is now back to square one and being in big trouble. As Chris is able to apply that triangle hold, putting pressure on the arm and the shoulders of Beth. Beth does not look so good as she gets hit in the back of the knee again by Chris. Going up on top again. What she got planned? Diving elbow drop. Executed by Chris Kennedy. Chris the icon Kennedy. Now ready to set up Beth Nassen with a patented finisher. The suspect chin music. The suspect chin music has been executed on Beth Madison and it looks like she's not going to get up from this one folks. One, two, and she gets the three. Your winner in this match, Chris the Icon Kennedy. As we see the Patriot checking up on, on Chris, making sure that she isn't hurt. I doubt she was hurt at all. She was handling things pretty well on her own in this match. Beth put in a great effort, a very, very great effort. But in the end, Chris the Icon Kennedy came out victorious with that win and the pin. And we will be right back with more action here on MWSAT. Don't go anywhere, or else you will miss it all.